Hi, in this video, I'm going to show you some comparison shots taken by Sony 18-105 f4 G lens and the Sony 28-70 f3.5-5.6 lens. One is crop lens, the other is full frame, and I use both of them on the Sony A6300 a crop camera. And I want to see whether or not the crop lens performs better than the full frame lens on the crop body. The first shot was taken by the 18-105 G lens at 18mm, which the other lens doesn't have this focal range. It starts from 28, so there's no direct comparison, just to show you this picture. And then we move on to the comparison. Uh, first, I show you the 18 to 105 G lens at 28 millimeter compared to the kit lens, full frame kit lens, 28 to 70 at 28 millimeter, and you can see that uh, the crop lens, G lens, has more contrast here. It's more contrasty, and the color is richer. Zoom in a little bit. This is a 500 percent zoom. The 18 to 105 millimeter lens shows just a little bit more detail. Next shot is taken at 50 mm on both lenses. And again, you can see the difference in the color, in the contrast. And when we zoom in, you can see slightly difference in the detail. Next shot is taken at 70 mm. This time is taken at f5.6 on both lenses. The picture taken by the G lens seems to be brighter and more contrasting. When we zoom in, here's the detail. As you can see from the light on top right corner, the G lens is indeed sharper, more detailed. Next shot is random street. Uh, first, gonna show you this uh, G lens at 18 millimeter. Um, zoom in. Next, gonna show you at 28 millimeter. Compare them. They look almost identical, except that 28 to 70 millimeter lens was a little bit zoomed out. It seems wider than the G lens. And we take a look at the 500% zoom scale. It's quite obvious that uh, the G lens compared to the full frame lens is a little bit zoomed in. The full frame lens seemed a little bit wider. And from looking at the sign, you can tell that G lens is slightly sharper, but not too much. This next shot is taken at 50 mm f4 for the G lens. For the full frame lens, it's taken at f4.5. And therefore, the image is a little bit darker. We zoom in. This time, the full frame lens looks better. Next two shots are taken at 70 mm at f5.6. And here we zoom in by 800%. And you can see that the G lens still provides more detail. Next one is the G lens at 18 mm lens indoor shooting portrait, and then 28 mm compared to full frame lens and we give it a 500% scale. Almost identical, but judging from the eyes, the G lens is indeed sharper. Next set is at 50 mm and looking at the eyes, the G lens is slightly sharper. Next set is 50 mm. It's the interior of the restaurant, a gun and the badge decoration. And here's a zoom on the badge. Judging from the edge of the badge, the G lens is actually sharper. Overall, the G lens is slightly sharper than the full frame kit lens, but not by very much. But the G lens provides a much wider range of uh, focal length and also provide power zoom, which is why I bought this lens. Full frame kit lens is kind of limited in terms of uh, focal range and uh, aperture. Thanks for watching.